on YouTube, LA Engineer here, and today we're going to talk about a very important topic, partial differentiation of matrices, or matrices. So why would you want to partially differentiate a matrix? Well, in multi-body dynamics, we use this to find out what the Jacobian is, and we use that to do things with position. So... Without further ado, if we have a matrix R of Q, where Q is a vector of x, y, theta, or x, y, phi, and we have an example of uh, two rows here, one column, two rows, x plus 2L cosine phi and y minus 2L sine phi, we end up with a, this is a, well, it's sort of like a matrix of vectors, but anyways, each one of these is also a vector. So we have a 3 by 1, or sort of a 3 by 2, if you will, um, matrix of dr dx, x uh, dr dy, and dr d phi. And then, and of course, each one of these is a two by one. So we come down here and we say, all right, partial of this with respect to x is one, partial with respect to y is zero, it goes right there, partial with respect to phi. This is a constant, it can come out front, so we take 2L times the derivative of this, which is negative sine phi, so we get negative 2L sine phi. Same thing for the second row. With respect to x, the derivative is 0. With respect to y, derivative is 1. And with respect to phi, the derivative is, we'll bring this out front, negative 2L times cosine phi. So there you have it. Let's do another quick example just for the fun of it. Let's say R of Q, and we'll make this a little bit easier in one way. Let's say R of Q equals x squared plus y cubed plus phi to the fourth plus the how about gamma to the third as well as x y plus phi gamma there that ought to be sufficiently annoying so rq we have two functions, m equals two, we have four variables, so we're going to end up with a two by four, so let's kind of come down here, we'll do our little, little division over here, little division over there, little division, one, two, three, and... So over here we'll have dr dx, dr dy, dr d phi and dr d gamma. So let's take a look at what we have. First row, 2x, we have 3y squared, 4 phi cubed, and 3 gamma squared. On the second row we have y, the derivative of x, y plus this with respect to y is x. Derivative of this partial phi is gamma, and the derivative of this partial gamma is phi. So here is your r, should be a q, r sub q. We have a four by, sorry, a two by four, Let's say two by four, matrix with 2x 3y squared 4 phi cubed 3 gamma squared in the first row and y x gamma and theta in the second row so this is how you do the partial differentiation of a matrix like comment subscribe and i hope this was helpful